And next up, we have uh, Kesuke Takahashi, who's going to be talking to us about localization on PostgreSQL. Thank you very much, Kesuke. Great to have you here. Yes, thank you too. Yeah, let's get started. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, welcome to this session. I'm Kesuke Takahashi. Let's get started about the session localization on PostgreSQL. Here is the agenda. First, uh, I'll give you an introduction of the session. And next, I'll show you PostgreSQL's localization features, specifically character set, local, and collation. Again, welcome to the session. Uh, I'm showing you welcome greetings in several languages, mainly in Asia Pacific. Here's my brief self-introduction. I'm Keisuke Takahashi. The pronunciation might be difficult for the speakers of languages that have clear and strong accents. You can put accent anywhere in my name, as you like. Keisuke, Keisuke, or Keisuke. I have been working at Microsoft for one year. Uh, my former job was a software engineer at a famous Japanese company group. And I have been working with open source software, including PostgreSQL. Yeah. I described targeted audience in the session. You are expected to already know character encodings, including UTF-8. And I guess you have some experiences about PostgreSQL. The session will also be fun for you if you're interested in foreign languages. Here is today's goal. I will briefly recap the localization features of PostgreSQL, and you can choose local and correlation along with your workload. Before entering the main topic, I'll share you the description of Azure Database for PostgreSQL. Now it consists of three types of database servers, namely single server, flexible server, and hyperscale. You know, CIDAS is used in hyperscale. In the session, I'll use all of them for comparison or use hyperscale for main environment. So let's get started with the main topics. It is worth understanding the different settings of the environments. Or Azure PostgreSQL products support UTF-8 as a different encoding despite of the differences of the operating systems. Sorry. Single server runs on Windows, flexible server, and hyperscale run on Linux. In PostgreSQL, databases are created based on a database template. So it is important to know the settings of each default template. There are differences among the three products. As you have seen, hyperscale supports UTF-8, and generally speaking, PostgreSQL country supports 34 character sets other than UTF-8 for server-side encoding. If you want to set a character set for database, you need to specify it on database creation, uh, like, uh, like the SQL 
create a database. Uh, and uh, you can do it both with SQL and PostgreSQL client command, uh, like uh, create DB command and uh, init DB command. Next, local and collation. You can check your local settings using the SQL. Uh, select name, uh, setting uh, context from PG, PG settings. I described each parameter of the local settings and monetary and uh, numeric can be configured uh, with Azure portal via web browsers. Here's a comparison of different local settings among Azure PostgreSQL products. All of them are the United States English with UTF-8 encodings. You can set your locker when you create a new database in the same way that we've seen the slide that describes how to set your encodings when you create a database. After talking about locker, uh, now we will talk about the correlation. Correlation is sorting order. Possible Seeker has a lot of predefined correlations for many languages and regions. You can see them uh, with the Seeker. Uh, Search uh, from PG correlation. In this slide, uh, I'm showing you predefined Japanese correlations in each Azure possible sacred product. Single server, uh, flexible server, and hyperscale. For another example, you are seeing predefined Chinese correlations. It is much more than the number of Japanese ones. So uh, in, the, in the examples, you've seen core provider, Karma. Uh, like this, with C or I. C, C means libc, and I means ICU. Uh, ICU stands for International Components for Unicode. These are local and correlation providers. Uh, Let's see, it's a traditional provider until uh, possible secret version nine. I see you, uh, is a new one and it is smart and flexible. The topic in this session will be mainly about ICU, and I'm going to show you the benefits of the new correlation provider. Again, you can specify your encodings and correlation when you create a database. To use an ICU correlation, you can specify it in this timing. You can also create a new database template with your ICU correlation. It is very useful when you create multiple databases with your correlation. You can also specify your correlation for 
counts uh, in, your, in your table. And you can also specify your correction on select statement on the fly. We have learned the basics of character sets, local, and correction in PostgreSQL. Next, I'll show you sorting results with individual corrections through experiments. The environment is hyperscale. I conducted experiments on 10 corrections for English, Japanese, and Chinese, including both uh, Lucy and IC correlations. In the experiments, I used 165 Unicode characters or combinations, which I picked up from huge number of characters. I hope they will cover almost all of language population or usages in Asia Pacific, uh, namely Latin, uh, several Japanese uh, letters, uh, Ch traditional Chinese and simplified Chinese, Hangul, Chunam, uh, or Vietnamese, uh, Arabic, and Kyrgyz. Here uh, is a list of 165 characters or combinations. I understand Japanese language has both huge number of characters and complex combinations. So uh, Japanese characters uh, have Japanese character has full wise. Uh, Latin letters and numbers and circle digits. And uh, it's, uh, it's Roman numeral. Uh, and a par parenthesis digit. And uh, just uh, just a digit uh, in parentheses. And many uh, Chinese characters are shared uh, among uh, Japanese, Chinese, and uh, Taiwanese uh, traditional Chinese. And and uh, uh, Greek uh, letters, uh, alphabet uh, in parentheses or brackets, and uh, half whites or full whites, and uh, single half white space and. Uh, through white space. Uh, Japanese have Japanese letters uh, have uh, hiragana, uh, katakana, and half wise uh, katakana. It's very complicated. And some patterns uh, of uh, voiced sound marks. And uh, large, large letter and small letter. Uh, this wave, uh, this wave that these wave dashes uh, looks the same, but uh, the above uh, is 
the is uh, the letter in Mac OS and uh, the below uh, is in the Windows. Uh, these are different. Yeah, uh, very, very complex. And uh, this is uh, important for uh, Japanese uh, Japanese companies or uh, Japanese database users uh, because um, uh, this uh, this is uh, used frequently uh, in uh, Japanese uh, in Japanese uh, company names. And they are different. Uh, these are uh, these are uh, Japanese uh, Japanese original uh, Chinese characters, and uh, you know emoji and uh, half wise, full wise. And uh, Chinese characters uh, uh, used in Japan, uh, mainland China, mainland China, and uh, Taiwan. Uh, these uh, these letters has the same meanings. And Hangul, uh, Vietnamese Chinese. And so on. So uh, here are the secrets for preparing tables. From here, I show you the results, orders of solid characters or the combinations. The first result is about EN US ETF8 correlation, which is a different correlation in Azure PostgreSQL Flexible Server and Hyperscale Citus. I marked up strange points with pink rectangles. It's based on my sense. For example, number 065, uh, through words exclamation mark, is far from regu regular exclamation mark at position number 002. It's very far. And uh, each result is described in two slides separately. Number 001 to uh, 088 in the first page, and the rest in the second page. Using EN US UTF 8. Three styles of Chinese letters, Japanese style, traditional Chinese style, and simplified Chinese style are separated in the solid results. Uh, this one, uh, this one, and this one, and this one, this one, and this one. Next. ENUS XICU. It is an ICU uh, correlation for English in the United States, and the result looks very natural for me. All Roman numbers are treated as alphabet, not number nor symbol. Next, uh, JA JP UTF 8. The result is quite different from EN US UTF 8. And there look some unnatural points for me. Uh, uh, like this. Uh, mm, 
why why they are here and uh, this character is separated uh, from uh, other other uh, the other letters other symbols uh, which which have the same meaning and this one this one this one Next, uh, JAXICU. Uh, the result looks uh, natural for me. But I cannot say why the order rule of Chinese characters from number 144 is like that. Uh, here. Next. Uh, JA, JPX, ICU. Uh, the result is the same as the previous JAX ICU. That's it about Chinese, uh, sorry, that's it about uh, Japanese creations. From here, I'll show you the results about Chinese creations. The first question is the HCN UTF 8. It is similar to uh, EN US UTF-8, and I found uh, the order of some of Chinese letters is different from that. They are uh, separated, uh, despite of the same meaning. Next, uh, ZHXICU, this is like JAXICU. And the order of parentheses stock characters, uh, this one, uh, is different from that. Next. Uh, ZH, uh, hands, uh, XICU, which is a Chinese ICU correlation for simplified Chinese. The biggest point is the order of Chinese letters. It is different from the Chinese ICU correlation for traditional Chinese and uh, ZH, hand, XICU correlation. Uh, this one. So, uh, which correlation and uh, sort of order do you feel the most natural for you, for you or your workload? From here, uh, let's see the performance of each correction. I got calculated costs using X-Plane and uh, measured the actual performances using Analyze. I conducted the test not only for tables where each correction is specified when creating tables, but also for queries specifying corrections on the fly. about the calculated costs. All total costs except JAXICU were the same. JAXICU was worse than other correlations. But specifying JAXICU on uh, EN, US ETF-8 table on the fly performed faster than that. Uh, this one. Country, I'm not sure about the reason. Next, I'll explain actual times using analyze command.
I got the results 10 times for each correction and got the median for each of them. Here is the result of the total time comparison. The result was quite different from the calculated costs. JAJPXIC correlation was the fastest in the results. The different correlation uh, ENUS ETF8 was the second worst. So I recommend you to change the correlation by specifying your correlation for more performance. So the correction is, uh, sorry, uh, so the uh, conclusion is following. First, uh, using Azure PostgreSQL secret ciders, you cannot specify your local and correction for database, so you must do it for tables. I noted it in red in this deck. Second, I see correlation is better than libc, not only for the natural sort order, but also the actual performance. Third, setting up ICU correlation for each table is better than using correlate clouds uh, with ICU correlation for different uh, libc tables. Uh, these are uh, my references. Uh, sorry for uh, Japanese title. So uh, that's it about my presentation. Uh, I think all PostgreSQL users need to consider localization, especially correlation, no matter whether you are a native English speaker or not because of the third order and the performance. Thank you for listening to my presentation. Uh, uh, I'm happy uh, if you keep in touch uh, with me uh, in the SNS or uh, Microsoft Open Source Discord. Thank you. Thank you very much, Kesuke. I must say this is a topic which you've opened up a lot of interesting details about, which I wasn't even close to aware of. Um, we have a question inside the Discord where it says, did your experiments reveal bugs in the GNU, the GNU, libc collation? I'm assuming ICU works better. Uh... Uh, uh, actually, uh, I, uh, uh, I, uh, I didn't uh, uh, GNU uh, mm -hmm. to live C, uh, and uh, I didn't uh, uh, get the result uh, like that. Yes. So someone, someone says here. I, well, I guess the conclusion answers my question. Use ICU. Mm -hmm. So that's that's fantastic. Yeah. Thank you very much. And uh, if anybody would like to ask any more questions, Kisuke, uh, aka.rms slash open dash source dash discord. Um, thank you. Thank you so much.